let's break down how to get to the secret area of Scataview, north of Shadow Keep, and Elden Ring's new expansion, Shadow of the Erd Tree. Although this area is right next to the keep, you can't get there through traditional methods while clearing the dungeon, as you have to exit out of a secret area you can only get to through the currently flooded church district. And the path to this church district begins all the way down here in Morth Ruins. Jump into this hole, and follow the lights all the way down to enter a cave path. Continue east along this path, until you reach the ladder leading up to Bonnie Village. Once coming out of the well in Bonnie Village, grab the Side of Grace and head northeast. Cross over the ditch running through the town, and then ride north. Just a little ways across the field, you'll find an abandoned statue in a certain pose, and interacting with it will give you the Oh Mother emote, which will be very important later. Head south back to Bonnie Village, and follow this path east across the bridges until you turn north. Follow the road until you hit the Church District High Road Side of Grace. Continue heading northwest until you enter a tunnel that leads straight into the church district. When you arrive here, it'll be flooded. You'll need to jump your way across the rooftops, fighting or avoiding a bunch of crabs, and one of these dudes I hate so much. Until you jump over to this stone path, head up to the roof, drop down onto this beam, drop down onto this path, and then take a right before taking the first left. Follow the path around, climb the ladder, and open the sluice gate to drain the water. Now that the area is no longer flooded, fast travel back to the first side of grace you encountered when entering this area. Your goal is an elevator here, so drop down and head to the left until you can enter this building. And then run to the elevator on the right side. Once reaching the top, take out Mesmer's fire dude before taking the first right to another elevator. This will take you all the way to a secret area within the specimen storehouse in Shadow Keep. Take a left and activate the back section side of Grace, and continue onto the ladder. Stealth kill the fire dude at the top, take a right to go up the stairs, and hug the right wall until you find a hole on the outside. Jump out the hole, take a right, and continue the path to re-enter the building. Activate the loft side of Grace, and then take the nearby elevator to the rafters. Keep in mind you'll have bats up here who throw sound waves at you, so try and take them out from range, or keep a shield up so you don't get pushed back and off the path. Follow along the rafters until you reach a ladder. Go up, take a right, continue forward until you come face to face with a bat, and jump down to the lower path to your right. Keep going forward until you see a ladder on your left. Take the ladder down, turn to the right, and head out another hole in the building to see an elevator on your right. It will take you down to a bigger elevator that goes all the way down to the back gate of Shadow Keep. You've got a pretty gnarly boss fight now keeping you from continuing, but once you defeat him, you'll have opened up the path to Scataview to the northwest. Make sure you pick up the Scatter Tree fragments by the chalice, but there's one more step. Just to the right of the back gate side of Grace, there's a small chapel and a note that reads Have Mercy. Use the O oh Mother emote here in front of the statue, and you'll open up a new path to the hinterlands of Scataview. Need any more Elden Ring tips? Make sure to check out our wiki on IGN.com, or one of the many YouTube guides we've been posting. And for everything else gaming, keep it right here on IGN.